and welcome to Scott's Inverts. I'm Scott. These are the inverts. We're going through major renovations in the spider room, so I do apologise for the mess in here. The racking's um, being built. The rest of that's going to be um, up and running by the weekend. But we have got a box which says this way up urgent live animals to Scott. Love you always, your one and only sugar daddy, Princess Richard. Wow. Earlier on in the year, we had a bit of a discussion and a bit of a bet. Um, and he won. So I had to shave off my moustache, which was growing, it was sticking out the sides, it was absolutely amazing. So in retaliation for that, I knew the guy does not like scorpions. Well... I say does not like it, more to the point he's scared of scorpions. So I sent him a creature crate with a scorpion in it, which then <laughs> actually went on to sting him. Um, but yeah, he's, an, he's, he's, a, he's just a big wimp, is Richard. Um, but there's been revenge planned, and whatever in this, is in this box is revenge. What he said was, Scott, it's not going to annoy you, it's going to make your missus punch you in the face which has got me extremely worried because I do love Tara very, very much um, and I don't want her to be mad with me. So, what is in this box is a mystery. So, I'm going to go and get changed. We're going to open it together and have a look to see what the idiot has sent. In revenge, what we are doing is we are going to his... Clint's unboxing video and we're commenting Princess Richard and if we get 20 comments on there he's got to dress up like a princess for the next Scots Inverts live that he joins us with so please please go and do that I am dreading what's in here guys it's open we haven't looked inside I do know one thing that's in here um, that he's put in um, but I don't know anything else Oh my god, he did mention the video that I did when I ordered crickets and they all escaped um, because they were loose in the box. So I am very worried. That is Northern Exotic sticker. Really, I do actually like that sticker a lot. So, so what's he put in? Is there anything loose in here? I tell you, I'm going to go ballistic. So he's put in. Oh, that is the sticker. I didn't know he was going to put this one in as well as the... Um, I'm a bit scared to put my hand inside. As well as the corn snake one. Um, these are actually um, from a company called... Animal Designs UK. Um, they're on Etsy and I will put a link down in the description for you guys. They also do um, key rings and the and the information stickers. So these will be go that'll be going on Nangini's tank and that will definitely be going on one of the leopard geckos tank tanks. So that's pretty awesome. So thank you very much, Richard. Um, what's in here? Oh springtails. Do need some springtails, but that's not that's not very revengey. What what has he put in? He is an absolute nightmare. It could be bloody anything in here. So let's go a bit steady. Alright, so we have a reptile systems dot uh, eu sticker. Again, I'll put the link down to the description for those guys. Oh, ooh, oh yeah, he said he was gonna put some of these in. These are the um the more the, the vitamin for the reptiles and the calcium ultra for the leopard geckos. That's absolutely awesome. Coconut hide. That'll come in very, very handy. My god, what the hell has he put in there? More northern exotic stickers, and now he's Put in Mario worms. There's a dubia in that one. The Mario worms, if you put these in a dark place, they'll turn into the beetles and you can set up a your own colony. So we've got this is not looking good. If he has put anything loose in this box, I am gonna go mad. 
So we've got another Dubia, another Mario Worm. Another Dubia, another Mario Worm. And a couple of empty ones. Oh no, there's another Dubia in there. Are they loose in the box? Richard, I, I swear down, if they are loose in the box, Tara is literally going to come to your house. Another Dubia. Do you reckon that's it? I hope that's it. I'm going very steady in here. What the? More t Another tub. Another. Another dubia, another dubia. Another do no I'm gonna have to individually get all these out. What the That one's cellar tape down, so is that one. Oh my god. He has literally put loads of individually boxed live feeders in that is gonna take me ages. And there's empty ones. My God. This is going to take me absolutely forever. With empty what? Those loads. Come. Look. How many is in there? Richard, you're an absolute plonker. Absolute plonker. I don't even know what we're going to do. I'm going to have to take these out and put them in, into a container before Tara comes in and sees them. Oh my God. So Tara has seen the individual packaged brooches and Mario worms and she has seen the empty boxes and she's already got ballistic at me. Um, she's told me if I get any of them anywhere, if any of them escape, she is going to hurt me while I sleep. Well, thank you so much again um, for these though, Richard. That is literally going to go up on Nangili's tank. And the Leopard Gecko information sticker is going to go up on one of the Leopard Geckos. Um, just to give you guys a bit of information on these. Um, it just gives you a description of where the corn snakes are found, um, location, and then the conservation status as well. It's just a nice little information sticker. So that's going to be going up there on Nangini's tank. Again, we have got a ton of Northern Exotic stickers. Um, so when I get mine done again, I shall send some of these out um, with mine. But what do I do? What do I do with individually packaged? Mario worms, I'm going to keep those like that and put them in the dark. Because if I put them in the dark, they'll turn into the beetles and, and then we can add them to the colony. But the roaches... Got flipping tons. Tons of roaches. Right, anyway, so the guy's an absolute plonker. So guys, um to get him back, can you all please pop over to his Clint's Reptiles unboxing video and comment Princess Richard. Don't tell him his video was good or anything like that. Don't give him a big head. Just say Princess Richard in, in the comments. So then next time he comes on one of our lives, he's got to dress up as a princess. That's not a good enough comeback though, is it? I mean, this is, this is, the tosh was personal, but it was, it was in with Tara. Do you know what I mean? She was happy about that. It was all good. The scorpion wasn't personal. Well, he, he, he scared of scorpions. So, but this this has annoyed Tara, so now it's personal. So get over to his video, comment Princess Richard so we can get him dressed up as a princess on the next live that he comes on. But then also comment down on, on this video or send me a message over on Facebook or Instagram, Instagram Scott's underscore inverts, to how we can go on a wind up and get him back for this. Um, I'm thinking actually send him crickets loose in a box. Or should we send him the German ones? 
Mm. Anyway, guys, this is the end of the video. I'm just stressed. I can't even. I can't even remember what I was supposed to say. But thank you, everybody, for watching. Again, get a comment in down below so we can get some sort of revenge going, so we can pay the man back. Hmm. I'm thinking. I'm getting my brain thinking. But anyway, guys, as always, we shall see you again on the next one. Remember, do not tell him how good his video is on that King's Reptiles. Just put Princess Richard.